Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today is a vlog. You guys are always requesting vlogs. So today I'm taking you on a vlog of me going into the city of Wellington to work for the day. So I took public transportation. I took the train services that they have. And just so you know, <laughs> because it won't be obvious in the vlog, but when I left the city, it was on a Friday and some of the trains closed down. So I don't have much video of that because I was literally running to the train, one train to catch it. And then they offered a transfer service from another train station that was open um, back to where I was. So it took me about an hour and a half to get home. <laughs> so you're not going to totally see all of that, but I wanted to let you know that that's what happened, that the public transportation in Wellington, New Zealand is actually really good. Uh, it's just that sometimes they have some closed downs, but they generally will make adjustments to help you still get back to uh, where you originally wanted to go to. So without further ado, here's the vlog of me working in Wellington. Here we go. Okay, I am getting on the train. Man, I haven't been on the train in years. Got my tickets. It is really nice when you take the train into Wellington and it goes right along the harbor. You have amazing, amazing views. I would say that the train trip took about 15 minutes. There was a couple stops along the way, uh, but very comfortable and not a lot of people because I was taking it after I think it was around 9 30 a.m and then um so you have less people so we've arrived at the train station and unfortunately I just realized that running around getting the kids sorted and everything is I forgot to eat anything so I'm going to run into the new world that's right in the train station uh in Wellington and get myself something to eat so it's fun for you to see um a little bit about the grocery stores here um, in New Zealand and uh, this is New World. This is going to be more of a, a higher end one, I would say. And um, so yeah, I'm just gonna kind of show you some of the yummies that they have at New World. In the end, I just decided to get an apple because <laughs> nothing really looked good. And um, you know, I knew I was going to go to cafes later, so. Um, just got myself an apple and I'm on my way. So I'm so excited. It's a beautiful day to be in Wellington. I have a couple of meetings. Otherwise I will be working in uh, cafes. So it's Friday here in the city and you can see that it's not too busy. Um, I'm literally just going to walk through and just show you what I see when I walk through the city. And uh, I love it here. Um, what's cool about the city is that you can walk from one end to the other end of the city and uh, probably about 20, 25 minutes, depending on how fast you walk, of course. Um, and so it's really nice. So like however you get into the city, at least you know that you can walk everywhere. So you don't need to worry about trying to figure out how you're going to transport. I also get a lot of questions about parking. Now, parking, depending on the day and the time of day, can be easy or hard. Being from the States and being by close, by bigger cities, it is not that hard to find parking compared to like the US. Um, it's not super cheap to park. It depends. You know, there's lots of parking lots that you can go in or just on the street parking and pay from there. Um, so yeah, so I'm just walking around all over the city, kind of showing you all the cool spots uh, before I head in to get some work done at a cafe. So now I'm heading down by the waterfront and you can kind of see what it looks like along the waterfront. 
a lot of people outside, having lunch outside, reading books outside, just kind of soaking in the sun on this beautiful Friday. And I don't know what I'm gonna do. I've gone to my cafe, I've gone to my meetings, I don't know, I'm just walking around and thinking I could take the train back or I could just walk around. So I'm always attracted to the waterfront. So I am gonna walk around there for a while. And I'm actually thinking I'm going to go into the New Zealand National Museum called Te Papa and see if they have any new uh, things going on. I love Te Papa. Um, it's a free museum. So if you come to New Zealand, I highly recommend it. It's just really, 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 really cool.